Hi friends, I'm Dheeraj and today I'm going to discuss about electronic devices uh, and uh, I have taken the reference everybody might be familiar with this reference do not add any man so if you see the past or uh, previous question papers the question already has been asked like uh, if you see the 2016 question paper conducted by Indian Institute of Science they have given the MOS energy band diagram right one question was given so if somebody hasn't followed uh, this kind of a book uh, they may not be able to solve the question because everywhere you may have seen the notes uh, if somebody hasn't changed and the past uh, and previous coaching notes uh, have uh, been not updated and they are intact uh, the content is intact so you will have to refer such kind of a reference books in order to you know build a concept and uh, solve the question confidently at the time of examination so you may have seen this time in 2018 so many questions you know taken out from these kind of a books so this book is titled as semiconductor of uh, physics and devices right the basic principle and this is third edition you may download uh, you know it is available on uh, Google right so um, the name the author of a name is Donald Neiman and he's from University of New Mexico so you can read also about the author if you want if you are interested enough so you can also get an idea how to become an author and how to write a book right so I'm going to discuss in this book the content in briefs what are the chapters important uh, as far as uh, you know gate examination is concerned and which chapter belongs to e ESE right ESE syllabus so entire discussion would be uh, you know on electronic devices uh, keeping in mind the syllabus of gate examination and uh, ESE examination so uh, in the chapter first you may see the crystal structure of a solid right so this is important uh, for engineering services examination it is not important for gate because in the gate syllabus you may have seen the the topic begins with energy bands in silicon right so the crystal structure of a solid comes under material science for engineering services and uh, second chapter belongs to introduction to quantum mechanics so if you uh, clear your gate examination if you join any uh, MTA courses there and uh, as a VLSI specialization you are introduced uh, you know to go through induction uh, to quantum mechanics because nowadays you know everything is uh, all genesis belongs to quantum mechanics only uh, since uh, you know physics we study in 12th standard right so quantum mechanics has been a uh, phenomenal uh, you know concept and the uh, theory behind it is really amazing and fascinating if you find uh, a good professor to be taught right so induction to quantum theory of a solid chapter 3 this is also uh, you know important as far as the ESE examination is concerned and uh, from here chapter 4 the semiconductor in equilibrium right equilibrium means uh, if something is not externally applied you suppose you take some pn junction right so if there is a pn if it is not biased right uh, if externally nothing is applied so we can see the semiconductor is in equilibrium right and um, only uh, the physical uh, entity like temperature and everything all whatever operation you know belongs from physical uh and physical uh, that entity and which is uh, actuated or we can say excited so nothing externally excited called equilibrium right and uh, this chapter fifth chapter carry transport phenomena and non equilibrium excess uh, carrier in semiconductor and pn junction which is very important for gate examination and uh, PN junction diode, metal oxide uh, semiconductor, hetero junctions, right? The bi bipolar junction transistor, fundamental of uh, metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor, 
and metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor few concepts are additionally added here in this chapter so you can go through in brief and prepare a note the junction field effect transistor so this time question was uh, from solar cell again so you can go through from this optical devices though in pub in public pdf you know uh, chapter up to 11 uh, is given you know this chapter has been i don't know cut off i don't know how why but you can refer the you know hard copy and the semiconductor power devices this is important as far as engineering services are concerned and uh, isro examination so what are the selected symbols list of symbols you can go through you can understand get an analogy to understand entire book so if you refer this appendix you can uh, come to know which symbols are named as what right and the system of units conversion factors so these are not very important derivation of Schrodinger wave equation and all if you go through your MT courses you, there is an important factor you know you need to know derivation of Schrodinger equations and all but uh, for gate and ESE it is not required to be, you know to read to be read the units of energy electron boards right so few yeah so contents here given is so accordingly you have to study and uh, 